early 2020 starter pack. It's still the early 2020s though. What do you want about? Come on. Stop trying to make us think 2020 was as far away as 2010. Mobile game ad that's actually just a Candy Crush knockoff starter pack. Oh my God, are these things just everywhere. Some complex lore and plot, which involves a breakup for such a simple game. An image of a knockoff League of Legends character. Seems like it could be an action adventure. Oh no, you gotta save the ugly girl. Quick, take off those glasses. For some reason, that's what's made her ugly? Okay. The mobile game has somehow won 500 awards and is five stars. That is some very supportive bots you have there. Girl wears jeans to a wedding and everyone hates her now? <laughs> I have not seen that one. That sounds amazing. Easy at first, but gets really hard because you only have five lives. Well, that can be resolved with a mere $2.99 purchase for two more lives. Save the dead girl. How? She's dead! Save the starving man. Oh yeah, that's easy. Makes you click on it, but it takes you to a link for downloads. But download now to save millions of lives! When logging into an account becomes a video game. Starter pack. This one is easy mode. Click to prove you're not a robot. Surprise! Type in text as well! Did you type 250? You're wrong because the capture doesn't like you! Then there's this horror that's still being used. This one gets you stuck in an infinite loop. By the way, your login expires in five seconds. Hurry up. The final boss. I hope you're good at guessing games. No, wait, forget it. This is the final boss. Either way, this is how you will feel when you're trying to solve them. Especially this one. What the hell is this puzzle exactly? D what the frick? I feel very sheltered not coming across that sort of capture. Cost of living increasing starter pack. Yeah. Buying less food. Sorry, that sounds negative. Um, <clears throat> getting less for more. Uh, that still sounds negative. Dreading incoming bills. Staying at home, reading, or napping instead of going out. As long as you remember that making that choice makes the hospitality sector struggle and therefore it's your fault. How dare you try to be financially responsible. Canceling streaming services. Oh man, I'm recording this the day that they just like. Netflix bombed everyone's emails with the Hey, we noticed you're using this account in different households. So bye bye dad's Netflix. Guess it's back to singing sea shanties online and being a pirate. Doing extra work hours. New car in 2023 starter pack. Crossovers with model names from decades ago. Craptronic CVT. Ooh, but folks, it's a turbo. That means nothing. It, it means nothing. Decent mileage. I'm, I'm winking very aggressively when I say that. Manual option? Oh, you must mean that booklet thing that, that's in the, 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 the glove box. Yeah, right? Yeah. Took 14 months to arrive. The low beams. <laughs> Last day of beach vacation starter pack. A $50 shirt you will never wear again. <laughs> That's me, but with hats. Not packing well for the trip back. Because why make the transition back to reality any bit easier for yourself? I can't wait to sleep in my own bed. Small Australian town starter pack. Oh, here we go, boys. Yeah. My bread and butter. Police station that looks like someone's house. Yes. <laughs> I genuinely used to think they just lived there. Like you could pay to have your house become a police station. <laughs> Fire station is just a small shed. What you would call the snow of the tropical north. Random artillery piece to try and instill some sort of pride in our country as if like, See? We were in the World Wars too! Our navy isn't in shambles and only held together with rubber band and duct tape! Don't ask for a sauce on that! I don't want to get them in trouble! <laughs> The best bakery you've ever been to. I have a working theory that all small towns in Australia never overpopulate because they're constantly sacrificing their souls to the bakery that's local so that the food always tastes amazing. And only major store is an IGA. Otherwise, the only grocery store is family owned. Yeah, so an IGA. Average space video on YouTube starter pack. Says how we are so small compared to universe in every 30 seconds. Unrealistic black hole pics. Oh, congrats to the cameraman who took all this footage for us. <laughs> Scenes from Interstellar, talking about Mars all the time, but says nothing about how we will make it habitable or reach there. We are not even close to first level civilization at Kardashev scale. We get it, you think we're dumb. Ending it with the famous pale blue dot text. Also some epic sci-fi music from Hans Zimmer, because of course. YouTube music comment section starter pack. If this song doesn't play at my funeral, I won't die. Who's watching this in 2017? This song hits harder than my stepdad. <laughs>
<laughs> Who's not here from TikTok? <laughs> and it only comes in two spices. Windows Movie Maker Lyric Video or the actual music video, which is kind of not really that bad of a thing. Wanting to play an old, mainly Nintendo, game starter pack. Either using a classic console and the classic game, or emulate. FBI, open up! Uh, or pay extra for an online service that offers the game. Or pray for a port or remaster. Or buy the original game that is expensive as frick now, plus console if you don't already have it. Damn, it cost $150 now for a GameCube game? I... I should not have thrown away my old console games. Crippling Depression Starter Pack. Bad diet, bad self-esteem, bad sleep schedule. I uh, wanna hang out? No, I'm busy. Pushing friends away. Spending too much time here. Ho <laughs> ho! You should go outside. Oh wait, you can't afford it. Where's plain clothes? Damn, imagine your fashion choice being incorrectly associated with depression. Zero motivation. Feeling guilty for being this way. Wondering if doing something different in the past would have prevented this. Because falling into a rabbit hole reminiscing over a theory is absolutely going to help your state now. Either cries too often or can't cry at all. Either way, you can take exercise off your to-do list because that is a muscle. Tear ducts are a muscle. Therefore, you've exercised, okay? You're doing something. Ha! Tricked you into improving yourself, you idiot! Oh, no, you're crying again. No, wait, that's good! How to overcome depression on the very website you doom scroll on. I... Mm. You see how that could be a problem? Spending free time on activities you no longer enjoy. Hey, don't attack me and my feeling towards first-person shooter games, okay? Local Mexican restaurant starter pack. Named after a person. Albertos, Juans, Jose's. The greatest nachos you've ever had. Sells soda in a can. Looks like it hasn't been changed since 2005. Why is your menu a poster? Very low prices. In the middle of a random ass shopping district next to a dollar store. The villain in a kid's movie starter pack. Lair is a giant factory. They look like this because, let's be honest, the villain's capitalism. That's, it's straight up. I want all the power in the world! Calls beautiful things disgusting. Has a pet, usually a cat. Cause we all know cat owners are evil. At least one dumb henchman who calls them names like boss. Hello, my little friends. Where's a black hat? Waha, hey, 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 hey. You think your friends are gonna come and save you? Kills or fires at least one of their own for failing, often in front of the others. Oh, so this is Demon Slayer. Falls to death in something. Well, we can't show them literally dying. We've got to leave potential for a sequel. Russians staying in Phuket starter pack. Uh, why are they staying there? Why don't they just go home? Uh, what's wrong with home? Uh -huh. Duck lips. Always smoking. The influencers are always hustling. They're drunk! Lots of men that look like this. Absolutely coincidental increase in petty theft. Always look annoyed, never smile, never make eye contact, always rude. And cutting in line. Let's be real, none of us watching this video actually find this relatable. <laughs> Still a nice informative perception on what the world is like somewhere else. You know the food will be really good. Start it back. Half of the people there are construction workers. Nobody speaks English. The wall outside the building. Plastic cups and in a sketchy area. Man, you have accurately described my local Thai place. How do they do it? Are they are they taking a page from the bakery's books in small towns? Is that why my suburb's feeling less populated lately? Brazilian anime convention starter pack. That man cosplaying Jesus. Moopy! 95% of kids are dressed like this. Guarantee it's not because they're a fan of Naruto, it's just the cheapest online costume they could buy. After two hours in the convention, Convention. Yeah, that's every convention. Ramen is just cheap noodles with spices to make it look like what Naruto eats. And somehow they'll still charge you $20. You will definitely see someone using this. Anime music cover band. Cospopre. That older man who does the best cosplays. That group that is drinking slash smoking at the exit of the convention. Free hug sign attracting the very people they wish would never even touch them. Email group that always sits in a random place and taking a conversation. Those same cosplayers who won the cosplay play contest three years in a row. Because hey, go to play catch up on feeling like they're the top game after years of high school. A very famous slash legendary person life story starter pack. Parents didn't support and wanted them to get a normal job. Were homeless at some point. Felt lonely and misunderstood. Wanted to commit the super selfie. <laughs> I panicked, I didn't know what else to say. But managed to find a few people who shared their ideas. Were brutally rejected and told they would never make it at least once. Spent all their free time on their passion for years before they actually got any money or fame from it. And then spent all their money on equipment. Well, you know, if we're talking about musicians, I think there's also a typical thing of um, the person at the front row of uh, the main character's performance. They, they neck the person on stage. 
Um, yeah, I think that's pretty typical. I think we should highlight that when they uh, tell Elvis to get a haircut. Yeah, yeah, just a shameless plug. Moving on. Person selling overpriced junk at a yard sale. Dollar stickers. I know what I got. What they've got is some outdated Beanie Baby Schmidt. Utensils and tools clearly not in well for use anymore. Clothes improperly washed. Just a pile of tech stuff that looks like it does not work anymore. But the printed out screenshots of eBay. Oh, that is extra interestingly petty. I have not come across that. Sorry, mate. Just because someone's selling their booger for $39 on the internet doesn't mean yours is that valuable too. Being a teen in 2009 starter pack. Oh, God, I gotta think back. How old was I then? I would have been in grade 10. Okay. Thank God I grew out of my emo phase in grade 8. Now half of this doesn't relate to me. But God damn do I remember that dinosaur. Rat slash mouse main character in movie starter pack. Always have the size doesn't matter moral lesson in their movies. Like yeah, we get it. Chewing dirty rags is not your only hobby. Cats are always the bad guys, even though we all love cats in real life, and they are the ones saving us from these ugliest frick rats. Guys, I think the person who posted this has a vendetta against rats. Expectation of mice. Reality! Yeah, it's hard to see if there's a bias, I know. Self-described redneck starter pack owns gas guzzling truck that would drive horribly off-road, but nonetheless, you gotta pay for that flag decal. That's it's just a ritual. Weirdly defensive of their manhood, because it's, it's their, their only redeemable, redeemable quality. Owns at least one Confederate flag. Always smells like gasoline or tobacco. Owns at least two rifles. Wears exclusively cowboy boots everywhere. And only listens to modern country music. Like Hit and Run by Auntie Donna. That's a country music song. It is. Especially an American one. Yep. The reformed high school bully starter pack, Manly Man Edition. Also happens to drive a powerful truck that would actually be terrible off-road. When people can't get what they want from you, they either cut you off, spread lies, or recruit others to hate you. Greg, please just sign the divorce papers. Hockey dad, no airbags, we die like real men. I wear sunglasses designed for fishing. And oh look, I happen to have a career that literally allows me to be a legal bully. Ooh, didn't need to be a psychic to figure out that future form me. Unemployed and all rejection starter pack. Everyone's advice. Must be your resume. The job market. Me. Anyone hiring entry level? How it feels searching endlessly. Daily activities. If I could afford them! Preparing for interviews after months of searching. <laughs> Meanwhile on the news. It is an excellent job market. It couldn't be better. Old car in movie starter pack. Keys are almost always kept here. If keys aren't available, hotwire the car with ease. Never needs gas, just always has a full tank to drive for hours. What? How? Car that must have been sitting here for some time, but starts on first key turn and runs like new. Also something you're never gonna be able to not see again. No headrests. Ever. Oh my god, that's a lot to take in on this one. Types of little kids at a family reunion. Barrett. iPad is hella crusty. Oh god, oh the visuals. It's mine! Forces someone else to put his 50-piece Lego sets together. Raised by Coco Melon. Had his Nerf gun confiscated. Amelia. Doesn't talk. Well liked by elderly relatives. Uh, uh, I, don't, I don't know. What, what are they? Why are you always lying? Blames you for her actions. Don't you dare fall asleep while that glittery petri dish is out. And enforces gender roles on other kids. She's just practicing how to be hated on the internet. And Xander. Escaped to the festivities to catch wildlife. Nobody notices he's gone. His parents hope to leave before he comes back. Why don't girls like me? Start a pack. Thinks this is a social life. Literally what he does most of the time. Doesn't realize that his life basically revolves around flashing dots on a screen. Has no degree in addition to both about how intellectual he is. Oh, but don't worry. They know they're attractive. They just don't understand why women don't see it. World traveler in air quotes. Starter pack. How have you not been to Italy? How have you not seen the Eiffel Tower? Japan is living in the future. I don't know if I want hush hush xenophobia to be in the future. Canada was so foreign. <laughs> L, why would I want to go to India? Yo, why is New Zealand crossed out on that map? Actually, you know what? I'm glad. Don't go there. Don't even come to Australia either. Keep those places to us, please. The end of semester, starter pack. Crying. <laughs> Mental breakdowns. Studying for hours every day. Still failing. Overwhelmed by everything you have to catch up on. Leaving your room only to eat. Feeling like a disappointment. disappointment. Intern of Paramount Pictures in 1969, starter pack. Criminal background check. Lengthy NDAs. Root director. 
Typical props during my internship. Hey, wait a minute. Minimum wage. Night shifts exclusively. Wait, isn't this cruddy dust everywhere? Dirty shoes at the end of the day. But hey, cool movie sets and costumes. Something about this seems off. All the shady clickbait you find at the bottom of a news website starter pack. Doctors refuse to believe him. Then he was cured. Dot, dot, dot. Without this, it was worse than it could have been. How her bra saved her from forgetting best lines. What trainers will never teach you about the heart. One weird trick to losing five pounds while sleeping. Why Amazon hates it when sex is possible. Wait, what? <laughs> Disney mom starter pack. Guys, we need all the memory makers. Get on! The matching shirts. Unenthusiastic father that didn't really want to come along. Yes, John, we have to wait 50 minutes in a line to meet Snow White. <laughs> Obviously! 